Uh, hey guys, today I'll be showing you how to jailbreak the 1.1.4 firmware with WinPoon. That's Poon Digital for Windows only. And there is not going to be a 2.0 firmware demo in this video because it will make the video too long. So let's get started. So first what you need to do is go over to your home screen. And as you can see there are no apps or anything. So um, what I'm going to ask you to do is to put your iPod into recovery mode by pressing and holding the home button and the sleep wake button until the device reboots. Then when the Apple logo appears, take your finger off the sleep wake button. And then keep your finger on the home button until the uh, connect to iTunes logo appears. Okay, so you're going to make a folder on your desktop, call it 1.1.4 jailbreak. And I've got two images in here for the boot screens. Um, and the 1.1.4 restore file, which you can get off the link in the video description. So, what we're going to do first, we're going to open up Firefox, Safari, whatever you use <coughs> on Windows, and you're going to search for WinPoon. <coughs> the link is in the video description. Scroll down and click Local Mirror because I hate Rapid Share and it's slow and stuff like that. So while that downloads, I'm going to pause the video. Okay, so now that's done, you're going to um, <clears throat> close your download window and then you're going to close your browser. Go over, to, go over to your desktop and drag over the WinPoon Ra over to 1.1.4 jailbreak. open 1.1.4 jailbreak up and right click WinPoon the WinPoon RA and click extract here. I'll spawn an installer and double click that. It's just a simple next next install. So when it's installed you'll see this notepad window and close it. Then click finish. Now it's created a um, WinPoon shortcut on your desktop and you're going to drag that over to the 1.1.4 jailbreak folder. Double click on the shortcut, wait forever, and if you get a bubble from Zone Alarm or whatever you use, just click allow. Okay, so now you're going to do a control alt delete and um, you can look for either iTunes or iTunes Helper. See your iTunes Helper. But no iTunes. So you're just going to kill iTunes Helper. Nope, no iTunes. Uh, but iPod service, um, I think that's alright, yeah, so just close the task manager, and um, go browse, browse IPSW, click on your desktop, then 1.1.4 jailbreak, and then your 1.1.4 restore. Okay, so just be sure to connect an iPod. And then click iPuna. And while it does that, I'm going to pause the video. Just so you know it um, puts scrolling white text on the screen. Okay, so I'm all pooned up. And uh, just waiting for a reboot at the moment. Okay. Uh, don't worry about that. Um, I clicked something wrong. Uh, but now just follow what I'm doing. So you click IPSW Builder. And uh, let it load up the 
sources then you're going to click on app tab official Just keep waiting for it to load okay and under categories you're going to click all packages and under all packages you're going to search for installer yep so just double click that and it's in there so you can install anything else from here you want but that's all I want okay now custom boot logos and recovery logos so boot logo I've got one ready and restore logo uh, doesn't work I'll just use one on their online database mm. Yeah, that one, that one will do. Okay, so we'll set up and then click build the IPSW and then click save. Sorry, then click desktop, 1.1.4 jailbreak, then click save. And uh, while it jailbreaks the file system and the pause the video. Okay, so it's uh, made my IPSW. So click OK. And there's your custom restore. Mm -hmm. So now we're going to go ahead and open up iTunes. If a firewall bubbles come up, just click allow or OK, whatever. And it detects my iPod. Just click allow on this bloody thing. Now, because we're on Windows, you're going to shift click restore. Okay? Then you're going to choose your custom iPod restore and click open. Okay, so while it does that, I'm going to pause the video. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um give your iPod a name on this bootcamp XP partition I don't have any songs so just click done and now I'll show you how to get the January upgrade free <laughs> 